Okay, what is up? What is good? What is happening, guys? And welcome back to a new video. Today's video is a bit different. It's not a vlog. Uh, it's not a challenge. It's not something to do with fitness. It's going to be an unboxing. Uh, and it's an unboxing because Nokia have been very, very kind. And uh, because Nokia have been kind enough to send me out uh, the new Nokia 7 Plus to test out and take pictures for them. So. I thought I might as well do an unboxing. Yeah, I'm not gonna go fully into detail about what the features are. Got a package this morning. I have opened the package just to make sure it is the phone. I thought it was food. I'm not gonna lie, I thought it was food at the start. Like a, a vacuum packed, I don't know, ready meal or a fresh meal. Come in this. And then inside we have the box. I did have a Nokia at Christmas, I had a Nokia 6. Loved it, very cheap phone. It only cost me about £150, brand new. But it was an older model, so it was just a bit too slow for me. So I upgraded to the Samsung S8 Plus. But I have got very, very high hopes for this Nokia. Because Nokia phones were just amazing. So my packs come with a cheat sheet on how to do selfies, how to transfer, just a bunch of sheets on how to transfer data across uh, and then we have the box so let's i can't wait i, I haven't seen it yet uh, i've just seen pictures online but it's meant to look like that uh let's get it open we've got the seal so it's brand new unopened oh, no going back now oh wow so it comes in the box just like a standard phone really before i get into the phone i'll show you what's in the box so We've got your little key to uh, take out your SIM card, take it in and out. Again, I'm not a phone tech, I've, I'm not really technical, so don't know the proper names for it. Is it a pin connector? I don't know. Something to get your SIM card out. Uh, then, whoa, okay, so this is the first phone that I've ever had. It's come with a case, so it's come with a nice silicone see-through case to put on your phone, straight out of the box. Never ever have I got a phone that's come out with Case. Guessing you start a manual and then in this box right here, I'm gonna assume this is your charging cable. Yeah, so you've got your USB C charging port cable thing. You've got some headphones which they look very they look decent quality, you know, metal on the top. Go to give them a try, and then your power bar or your connector to your plug. Just standard really. Black, I don't really know what watts it is. Does that matter? Haven't a clue. But yeah, oh, but yeah. So that's what's in the box. You have the case, you have all your charge, just standard phone stuff. Now let's get into the actual phone. So this is what it looks like. Moment of truth. I really been waiting for this for about a week and they said they were gonna send it out just to hold it and feel it. Off first impressions, it looks beautiful. It feels quite weighty, but not too weighty, not not as thin as other phones uh, and as light where it feels like you're going to drop it but it's got a good sturdy hold to it. Now I'm using the Samsung uh, S8 Plus at the minute and I've got to put a case on that because it's just too thin. This is quite thick so I feel like the typing on it and the texting will be uh, really really easy and feel nice. Gold and black or copper and black. It looks beautiful. It's got like a nice matte finish on the back. Your fingerprint scanner, dual lens, and that's really the whole reason why I've got this phone is because uh, I am going to start doing more mobile photography uh, and taking more pictures. So, you know, Nokia said that they're going to send me out their newest phone that's got the dual lens. So, I think it is. 13 megapixel camera and a 16 megapixel camera on the front facing one so excited to try that out that'll be in a different video when i review the phone it looks absolutely beautiful copper accent going around bezel the middle bit going around there you've got half and half in your headphone jack a nokia in copper in the back and then a copper ring around the fingerprint scanner and a copper ring around your camera again it's a protruding camera but most phones now have the camera sticking out a little bit and it says Android One so I'll have to do some research on that to find out what that means Android One when I'm doing my review but yeah like I said it's just a first look so I can't believe you get a case see it's a nice little silicone case we'll put that on there 
feels nice. So you get your case, you get your USB charging point, your headphones, you get your charger block, uh, starter booklet, and that's really it. But so far, I'm impressed, really, really impressed. With it. Oh, so it comes on Android One. I don't know what that means, honestly, haven't a clue. It's a six inch phone, slight little Nokia sign at the top with the camera. The classic Nokia sound. It'd be better if it was edge to edge, obviously. But I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and set all this up. Yeah, and have fun with it. Like I said, I really, really enjoyed my Nokia 6, like so much so that I didn't want to get rid of it. But I, I just loved I loved the Nokia phone, I loved the style of it and the feel of it. Especially some of the performances, some of the, the notifications and the way that they do stuff is just so much better. So I'll go ahead and explore that, review that, do whatever. So yeah, again, thank you Nokia for sending it out and getting it to me. Can't wait to start working with you guys and, and let you guys know about it. That has been the video. I know it's something different, but it should just be a quick, I'm gonna say it's about five minutes long. I'm not a tech reviewer. There's not a lot of information in there. It's just showing you what's inside the box and what the phone looks like. If you have liked the video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you haven't already. Share it with all your friends and comment down below anything that you wanna see in the future. I'm now going to spend the next couple of hours going through and changing over everything from my current phone to this phone because I want to be this as my daily driver. I guess I'll see you guys in the next one.